gives free energy equals the change in enthalpy minus temperature times the change in entropy. Since we're already given from the question that delta H, which is the change in enthalpy, is 10 kilojoules per mole, and that the temperature is 298 Kelvin, we also know that delta S, which is the change in entropy, is 10 joules per mole. In order to keep all the units consistent, we need to convert delta S from joules per mole to kilojoules per mole, which gives us 0 0.01 kilojoules per mole. Therefore, Gibbs free energy equals 10, which is the delta H, minus 298, which is the temperature, times 0 0.01, which gives us a positive value of 7.02 kilojoules per mole.